Baja California is still the best year-round catch south of the border. Visit discoverybajacalifornia.com and check out more ways you must do Baja. Mexico, beyond your expectations. This week in the galley, we're right outside of Ensenada in the wine country of Baja, Mexico. And where we are right now is in the vineyards of Adobe Guadalupe. It's a beautiful winery. And standing next to me is Carla. Hola. Thank you for inviting us Thank here today, Carla. Thank you for Carlos. coming. Thank you. And who's our chef today? Marta Manriquez. She's our chef from Adobe Guadalupe. Good. And what is it that Marta's going to be doing for us? Today, Marta is cooking um, almejas. Almejas al carbón. Almejas al carbón. So clams. Exactly. Okay, baked clams. All right, so how are we going to do this? How do we get started? Okay, Marta, ¿cómo vamos a empezar? Vamos a calentar un poquito las conchas. Clam shells. We will heat them very well. Okay, after these two minutes, the first thing is butter. Okay. okay. And okay. after that, she will add some almeja. The clams, well, the meat of the clams. Mm -hmm. That's the juice of the clam. Oh, okay. Remember when you open the clam, mm -hmm. the first thing is the juice inside. So she saves the juice from the clam. Yeah, she saves everything from the clam, and now she's putting everything together. And now she will add the the white wine. In fact, this dish is very good with white wine, mm -hmm. any white. Okay. People will just prefer their to, favorite. To drink know? with it. Yes. Mm -hmm. So you can use the same wine to cook with and then drink. Yes. Now is a pepper uh -huh. to give the flavor. And all these ingredients that we're using today all come from the area? They're yes, all pretty they native are from Mexico? local, local, and we have this um, vegetable garden mm -hmm. where we have, uh, well... And you get the parsley and all the stuff. Yes. From. Okay, we will leave it there until it starts boiling, okay? And okay. meanwhile, she's cooking this, she will make a special bread for us with okay. her olive oil. Oh, okay. We make olive oil here. We have 150 olive trees from where we make this, and it's from La Misión and Manzanita olives. Mm -hmm. It's first press, cold press, extra virgen, and it is delicious. Extra okay. virgin. Marta? The bread is baguette, remember, French. French bread. And now she's adding our olive oil. Okay. Which is called oliva. And then she will add Un poquito de ajo. garlic. Mm -hmm. Before this, she had a pan just ready. Mm -hmm, just heating up. Just heating up. Y paprika. Paprika. Just okay. sprinkle a little bit of paprika. And, uh, and now, facing down to the pan, mm -hmm. we will just put the bread. It's pretty oh, simple to make. Delicious. Yeah, we just waited until it was boiling, and it's set. Muy bien, podemos probar. Now she's adding perejil, parsley, a little fresh parsley. Muy bien, <laughs> gracias. Thank you, Martha. This looks so good. Oh, it doesn't. Okay. That mm -hmm. is delicious. Muy bueno, Martha. That's very good. Just a beautiful dish. Just the beauty of the valley here, outside of Ensenada, the whole wine country is gorgeous. But to be here at Adobe Guadalupe is just breathtaking. It's just Thank a great you. place. The food's wonderful. The wine's delicious. If you've never been down this part of Baja, Mexico, you got to make a trip down here. It's a great family location with the horses, stables, everything. There's just so much to do here. Yes. Thank you very much. It's a great dish. Thank you. If you need more information, you can visit their website. You can also go to the website for the Baja Tourism Board. Everything's there. Fishing information, the wine country, everything you need to know. Well, let's get back on the water and show you more exciting action right here on Sport Fishing. Mexico, beyond your expectations.